mess for all the peripheries. This is global interrupt enable. It disables or enables all the interrupts. So that's about it. So since this uh, interrupt is so important, it also has a register associated with it. It's called int control. Interrupt control register int con. That's on the page three of this manual. So that is uh, uh, the bit seven of this is a global interrupt enable. If you look at the register over top of this, the khana screen share ni or So uh, if you look at the top of this, uh, this uh, uh, over here, yeah, this highlighted the R W and dash zero ka kya matlab hai? ये वाली बिट जो है ग्लोबल इंटर इंटरप्ट नेवल बिट है ये बिट सेवन है आर डब्ल्यू डैश जीरो का मतलब ये है कि दिस इज अ रीड राइटेबल बिट यू कैन रीड रीड फ्रॉम इट यू कैन राइट टू इट एंड इट्स डिफॉल्ट वैल्यू ऑन स्टार्टअप इज जीरो सो दैट वी टेल यू दैट बाय डिफॉल्ट ऑल द इंटरप्ट आर सेट टू जीरो सो दिस इज द फर्स्ट लाइन मीन the very first line sorry line select kare uh, very first row this is what this means uh, that what is the default value and is it right some bits you will come across they are by default one some bits you will come across they are unimplemented so they dash there means you do these bits are not used and uh, so so dash n means value at power on reset p o r means power on reset so so this is the description of all the bits so bit 7 is global interrupt enable you can also say int con dot bit 7 equal to 0 so that would be same as saying GIE equal to zero. So, bit, bit decibel uh, memory. Uh, there is another very interesting uh, interrupt that is a change on port B. Uh, that is uh, uh, that any a port B is connected to say something complete of port B is connected to uh some uh, devices that are giving input so this should be as an input port and they these devices are changing very slowly in time like a fire alarm agar set ho jata hai to koi output high ho jati hai so fire alarm can be set by you know in once a year or something like this. Uh, so these are, uh, or Gadi agar koi gudarti hai port ke aage se to ek bit high ho jati hai. So in that case, you know, any change on the port B will set uh, an interrupt. So then you can go and check which bit is in the, in your interrupt service routine, you can check the concept port ki bit zero uh yeah bit seven may kiss cooper interrupt it and how can i handle that so that's a good way it's basically uh, in sorry inputs ko r karke ek gate pe de diya r ni kya ho balke prani se jo bhi prani input hai agar usse change aati hai to ye interrupt aati very interesting first karen sorry agar bit bit pe one 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 hai agar koi bit zero ho jati hai one 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 zero ho jayegi to interrupt a jayegi so change on interrupt sorry interrupt on change change on interrupt ni interrupt on change so any change will cause an interrupt 
so that's uh, useful for your project or you, uh, uh, you know so these are different parts of this uh, timer zero interrupt flag uh, and so on so there is a full blown example uh, we given below uh, which basically based on timer interrupt and you can see here on page four that uh, whenever the timer uh, interrupt would occur it will go into the interrupt service routine so how do we how uh, how do you set the timer interrupt that uh, uh, that is the starting thing in the main main we in ncell b then we do tris v is equal to zero so that it is an output port so let v zero means the output uh, port is initialized as zero 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 we load some timer values timer zero l and eight bit timer timer con and then we global interrupt bit equal to one so we uh, launch our interrupt and we do timer zero interrupt enable bit equal to one so that causes the interrupt to start so as soon as the interrupt come we come here and uh, we flip the latch so the led is turn on and off and then we do the timer bit equal to zero again and we reload the timer so with the value same value uh, note that uh, timer uh, okay. इंटरप्ट को हम कॉल नहीं करते ना इंटरप्ट जो है जब टाइमर ओवरफ्लो होता है यही तो हमने सारे लेक्चर्स में पढ़ा था शायद आप लेक्चर्स में नहीं आए तो जब इंटरप्ट कॉल नहीं करते तो इंटरप्ट बेसिकली क्या होती है मैं थोड़ा सा चले ये बता देता हूँ दोबारा जो लोग लेक्चर अटेंड नहीं करते रहे इधर करना याद रहा Uh, what are interrupts? Interrupts uh, basically is like you know uh, I gave an example in the lecture uh, that interrupts are uh, uh, who are compared versus the polling. Polling is when you पोलिंग की एग्जांपल मैंने दी थी कि आप मेडिकल स्टोर पे और पूछते हैं कि यार ये मेडिसिन आ गई है कि नहीं अब पिछले दिनों में हैंड सैनिटाइजर नहीं मिल रहे थे जब नया नया कोरोना स्टार्ट हुआ था तो आप जाके पूछते थे कि मुझे हैंड सैनिटाइजर है वो कहते नहीं शॉर्ट हो गए थे हैंड सैनिटाइजर सो सैनिटाइजर आपका नहीं है आप दो दो घंटे बाद फिर जाते हैं और पूछते हैं सैनिटाइजर है या नहीं वो कहते नहीं so that would be polling so aap kuch chhod ke baad repeat kar rahe hain apni apni investigate kar rahe hain ya apni input puch rahe hain hai ki nahi versus that interrupts are like this that you give your phone number to the shopkeeper so whenever a uh, hand sanitizer arrive in the shop uh, he can call you ki ji sanitizer aa gaye aake jaldi se le jaye i have mean very little quantity and they will be sold out soon so whatever now the do here whatever you are doing you are eating your dinner maybe you are sleeping maybe you are you know driving to some place you just stop whatever you are doing you go to the shopkeeper you get the hand sign and sanitizer and then you keep you may be lecturing i may be in lecture main lecture de raha hu main sabko kehta hu so jaye aur main jaldi se ja ke hand sanitizer leke aata hu wapas aur fir main class ko kehta hu jaag jaye unko ye ehsaas hi nahi hota ke i have been out of the class so interrupts work that way so the main program uh, main task is lecturing so this is the main task so i go to interrupt 
रूटीन में चला जाता हूँ कम बैक सो इंटरप से रिलेटेड आर कार्ड इंटरप सर्विस रूटीन सर्विस रूटीन these are uh, interrupt service routine all called isr so these are processes run when whenever there is an interrupt this isr so they are provide interrupt they cannot they are not called you can call them you can call them but usually they are not called and this is the format you cannot have anything here you have this there will be an error they don't return anything you can call and they how are they called how are they called that is related to uh, the interp service routine so processor has many sources of interps some interps are uh, uh, from the outside so a change on the interp a line so for example port b0 that bit 0 that can be called an int into 0 so whenever there is a transition from low to high you can set this ki apne low to high pe transition interrupt karna ya high to low so whenever there is a transition on this port then this can um, uh, invoke this uh, uh, isr software mein ye aap ise call nahi kar rahe that is the beauty of uh, interrupts you are not calling them in the software when there is a transition from low to high it automatically whatever the processor is doing so wo lecture de raha hai ya kuch bhi kar raha hai wo game play ho rahi hai आपने यहाँ पे कीबोर्ड हो सकता लगाया हो कि जब भी कोई की मैं प्रेस करूं तो इंटरप्ट आनी चाहिए अब वो की जो है ना प्रोसेसर ये तो नहीं कर सकता कि अपने मेन के अंदर बार बार चेक करे आपने की प्रेस तो नहीं की की प्रेस तो नहीं की की प्रेस तो नहीं की यहाँ पे आप जो है ना वो मैंने पहले जैसे क्लास में भी बताया था i can have a set detect if there is a car going on a road car bana deta hu yahan pe ja rahi hai sir maine तो कार इस सड़क पे जा रही है जब भी कार इस सेंसर के आगे से गुजरेगी गाड़ी हो सकता है दो घंटे बाद एक गाड़ी गुजरनी हो सकता है रात में कोई गाड़ी ना गुजरे रात में दो गाड़ियां पूरी रात गुजरे तो आप अगर आप आप सीपीओ को कहते हैं कि सपोर्ट थ्री पोर्ट We. Uh, uh, 